everybody. This is just a quick little video um, explaining what Tibetan Buddhism is. Um, there's a lot more to it than this video, but here's just a quick snippet. I hope you enjoy. I came from I came from this uh, Tibetan. I used to follow Tibetan Buddhism. Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you tell me this uh, Tibetan Buddhism? How how that is that started? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let, let me uh, talk to you. Give you some idea on this Tibetan Buddhism. Well, uh, Bud Buddhism was founded by uh, Siddhartha Gautam Buddha, who was born in Kapil Bastu in the southern part of Nepal. And uh, he he preached his first uh, sermons to his disciples at uh, Deer Garden. And uh, it is always you get to see in the monasteries there is a Dharma Chakra, is a wheel of life, and uh, on beside that Dharma Chakra there is near crouching uh, deer. Okay. That, that symbolizes that uh, he preached his first sermons to at Deer Garden to his disciples. And, uh, and, the, and the Buddhism is spread uh, in um, Asia, like uh, and even Japan, Cambodia, Vietnam, Laos, uh, Burma, and <coughs> Thailand, you know. And uh, there was a great guru during the 8th century, there was a great guru by the name Padma Sambhav. He was born in Peshawar, Pakistan, and and he was teaching. Uh, he was he, he used to practice uh, illusion, you know, and he was a great guru of Tantrism. Uh, Vajrayana Buddhism is a mixture of Tantrism, <coughs> and uh, he used to practice that. And he was he used to teach there at Nalanda University during eighth century. And in Tibet, that time Tibet, they have a local belief is called uh, Bon. Bon is a kind of uh, guru or black magic, you know. Yeah. And he was invited by the then king called by the name Tishan Gampo. And he, along with his followers, he went to Tibet. And what did he do was, uh, Bon, the local belief, he blended this to a uh, local um, a belief with this Bajrayana Buddhism. That is how the Tibetan Buddhism was born. Okay? And uh, the sect that he founded is called Nyingmapa sect. Nyingmapa sect means it's all unreformed ref sect. You still get to see some monasteries in Tibet and even in Nepal that belongs to Nyingmapa sect. And later there are other school of thoughts like Sakyapa, uh, Kagyupa, and Gelukpa. Gelukpa is the most popular sect among this Tibetan Buddhism. And Dalai Lama belongs to that sect, Dalai Lama. And he was the king of Tibet and he was a spiritual leader of Tibet as well. Okay? And he fled Tibet in 1959, I guess, around after the Chinese uh, the Chinese occupied Tibet uh, yeah and he fled Tibet and he lives in India in Dharamsala UP Uttar Pradesh and he uh, he's worshipped by the Buddhist all Buddhist uh, as a living Buddha okay now and uh, he has entered over this political part to somebody else now he wants to handle only the spiritual side okay and he's the 14th uh, he's the 14th, he is 14 incarnations his incarnation is 14 the last incarnation of the Dalai Lama he incarnate okay mm -hmm. so this is the last incarnation of the Dalai Lama 14 so and uh, and that Tibetan Buddhism I come from I hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one bye